I'm Alexandra DiGiacomo from New World Fashion Magazine. I have come across the most interesting fashion store here in Tampa, Florida called Pirate Fashions. This is the first in a series of interviews with Tiger Lee about the secrets of how to dress like a pirate. How did this unique Dress Like a Pirate project come to be? Well, I'm glad you asked me that question. About three years ago, I decided I'm going to write a book on how to dress like a pirate because no one had ever done that. But as I was writing it, I came across documentation issues because I knew the stitch Nazis would want to know where I got all this information. And pirates didn't always write notes and have the picture taken, so there's little of it to be had. But my goal is to uh, increase the quality of pirating all around. And the only way to do that is to get the information out there so people can dress better. So I finally figured out the solution, which, which is forget the stitch Nazis. Don't focus on the most historically accurate pirate, but the middle of the market pirates, which are like uh, parade pirates, Hollywood pirates, as well as what we deem to be real pirates. And so once I figured that out, now it just makes sense of how I can proceed, and that's where we are now. What makes you qualified to write Dressing Like a Pirate? I, because I'm Tiger Lee and I've had enough rum. But the real reason is because I have done a lot of research through lots of books and articles. I have been to over 250 pirate events, so I've seen what's in the field and what people are actually wearing. I've done a ton of research online as well as through many old books about costuming and clothing and what people wore, as well as I've written a column in Pirate Magazine for three years. I have uh, did six years of uh, pirate calendars, and that for the past eight years I've run this store, Pirate Fashions, where we have scoured the entire world for the best pirate products to sell. And many times we find that no one makes it, so we end up actually making much of the clothing ourselves. And you get really intimate in your knowledge when you actually have to make the stuff. Our, you know, and much of our stuff is now being seen, you know, in TV programs and uh, pirate parades and festivals as well as in magazine articles and uh, pirate dinner shows and so you know we have uh, done a, a lot of research and I feel that you know I am more qualified than anyone else and I've had enough from now. <laughs>